Good morning. Today's Wednesday and we went to school this morning and then had to leave because Delaney's not feeling the best. I know I said in Monday's video or last video that her throat was hurting and stuff and it still does but she's got she had a really bad cough and stuff and it kind of sounds creepy. I don't know. I'm not going to say it's the croup. Um, and she's wheezing really bad. So we are getting ready. Um, in about an hour, we're heading to the doctor and see what they can do about that and see like what's going on and stuff. Lainey, how do you feel? How do you feel? Oh, you hear her. How do you feel? She acts like she feels fine. She just don't sound the best. You hear the wheezing? You probably hear. Yeah, you hear that wheezing. For I know I mentioned this in our last video as well. The um, fires here in North Carolina are really bad, and it's making our air quality terrible. It's so bad, and. It's so smoky outside and it stinks. It smells like smoke and stuff. And I think that has so much to do with it. I really think it does. Um, a lot of other people are having these kind of problems too. A lot of people are going to the doctor for it and stuff, I've heard. So I really think that has something to do with it. I don't know what they'll do. Maybe like, I'm wondering if they maybe just get like, give her like a breathing treatment. Steroids maybe. Um, I hate steroids for kids, but. I don't know. I just want her to feel better. And she hasn't been wheezing like this up until like this morning. She was wheezing a little bit yesterday, um, but nothing that I was like really concerned about. Um, but this morning, it just keeps wheezing and keeps wheezing. It's getting bad and stuff. So we'll see what the doctor does. But if you notice, we're in the nursery. Delaney loves coming in here. For a long time, we kept the door shut in here because. We would like throw all of our junk in this room. That sounds terrible. We'd throw like, like coats. We just throw them in here and just get them. I know that sounds terrible, but um, for a long time we kept the door closed to here. But now we keep it open. And Delaney loves coming in here and just playing. And she'll come and like come to the dresser and say, "That's the uh, little baby's dresser and the little baby's crib." So she's excited, aren't you? What are you doing? What are you doing? Hey, can you tell everybody how you feel? Say, so, so we had to leave school, didn't we? I can't. You can't get out. Are you stuck? Are you stuck? Hey, where are we going? Are we going to the doctor? Do you want to go to the doctor? No. No. It'll be okay. The doctor will be okay. It's not going to be bad. Say, so we're at the doctor. I just got my blood pressure checked and my height and weight so I weigh th over 30 pounds 30.6 and 36 inches ain't that right she didn't like her bullet pressure it like when it when she started squeezing it like I guess she squeezed it too tight or something and she started crying so, so that was a little unexpected um she possibly has pneumonia so we're headed to get a chest x-ray and go from there either possibly pneumonia um, creepy sounding as well or bronchiolitis or something but he hears rattling in our lungs and stuff and so he's thinking it might be pneumonia so we need to get a text x right and see what it really is all right yeah so let's go see what they say show me your bracelet oh, you got a bracelet don't you to get your chest x-ray you got a bracelet <laughs> she's gonna run it around here don't try to take it off don't try to take it off her cry. Her cry. She might. She don't want you to take the bracelet off she put on you. That wasn't so bad. Of course, Delaney thought the opposite. She was all that equipment in there. She kind of got scared of it. Did you get? Did you get pictures taken of your chest? Did you get pictures? Huh? Did you get pictures? You did. Oh, she didn't like it. But she saw all that equipment in there and automatically started like freak out mode. But if I was her age and I saw all that big equipment in there, I'd probably be the same way. But she did good and they got good x-rays but of course they're not going to tell me anything my doctor her doctor should call me within a couple hours he said let me know the results so we'll see if it's pneumonia if not we'll take another it's either pneumonia croup which um a little girl in delaney's class had croup 
or she actually went to the doctor today and di got diagnosed with croup today so there's a good chance that could be it but he heard rattling her chest so that's why he thinks it could be pneumonia but we'll see in different course of actions if it's croup or pneumonia one of them steroids one of them's antibiotics so let's see what it is and i'm gonna get home and try to get this little girl a nap because she's she'll actually probably fall asleep in the car she's she's not feeling really bad i mean i'm sure she i shouldn't say that i'm sure she probably don't feel really good but she's playing and stuff and talking to me and she just don't sound the best but i'm gonna try to get home and get her a nap and then go get whatever medicine she needs whenever i figure that out what are you doing girl oh got your halloween cup it's a little too late for that. We need a Thanksgiving cup. <laughs> what does it say? Say Happy Halloween? Oh, yeah. yeah. I was going to say pumpkins could be for Thanksgiving, but... Hey, you need to sit down. You need to sit down. Whoa! We don't have a lemonade, baby. Haley is washing the dishes. Just got done. And um, I figured I'd give you all a quick update uh, on Delaney. She does not have pneumonia which is awesome. Sounds like she's just got a bad case of the croup. Yeah, bad case of the croup. So... But, yeah, but I think it has a lot to do with the air quality here too, though. They say it's the croup, which it does sound like it, that cough does. Um, right. But right. the wheezing and stuff, like, I, there was a news station I saw it on Facebook saying symptoms of this air quality, all the smoke and stuff, wheezing, sore throat, which she's had both of those, cough like asthma symptoms and stuff and i think that has a lot to do with it but praise the lord she don't have any wrong yet at least right um uh, so they just gave her a uh an antibiotic and so she started that i went and actually not, picked not it up a steroid not antibiotic steroid i'm sorry yeah antibiotic won't do nothing she uh started a steroid i went and picked it up on my way home from work and uh by looking at her you wouldn't even be able to tell that she's sick right now yeah. just, just just like whenever she talks and every and once in a while she'll talk night. or she'll hey, call I wanna, so. I wanna, I wanna, um, get water you want water in there okay so um i got my ipsy bag this month and i got several goodies in it this time it's usually always pretty good but i got a new mascara in it and it was, what is it, Too Faced, it's this one, it's this one, so that was in it for this month, and um, so I, as you can tell, I do not have any makeup on right now, and I did earlier, but I can never try new mascaras, like there's one mascara that I use that I've been using for a long time, it's the only mascara that works for me, and it's this one, Maybelline something, I don't even know, Maybelline something. But, um, my problem with mascaras is it really, like, it fades, like, down here. And I'm constantly, all day long, wiping the black underneath my eyes. And this is the only one that does not do that. And that Too Faced one does the same thing. And, the, like, I've had, like, three or four different ones in my Ipsy bags for the past, um, since I've had my Ipsy bag. And none of them work. None of the expensive, high-end brands. This drugstore brand is the only one that works. So, I don't know what it is. I don't know if it's my eyes. I don't know if my eyes water and it makes it run. I don't know what it is, but that's what I've been doing all day. So, I was like, you know what? I'm taking my makeup off, makeup off at 3 o'clock. So, that's what I did. Anyways, I'll show you what else I got in my bag. Um, ghost oil and it, um, verb ghost oil. It's for your hair. Like, if I curl my hair or something, it can, like, tame the ends and stuff. I forgot that. And some eyeshadow stuff i don't care for that and a brush and that mascara and something else one two three four i'm missing something i don't remember what it was so there's one more thing i don't remember what it was anyways that's what i got in my bag this month i think the one i'm most excited about is this stuff because i need some new stuff to put in my hair after i curl it and tame it down and stuff. Also, my face is like breaking out down here, so that was another reason my face just needs to breathe and stuff. So I turn my makeup off to let it breathe right there. Catamounts, catamounts. Who goes, who goes to catamount school? Um, Ben Ben. Ben Ben, who goes to Western Carolina? And, and the flag, and the, and the, 
the girls say what this. Oh yeah, when we went to the football game, you saw all the cheerleaders with the flags. They were they were waving them flags and stuff. You remember? Yeah. Where's that? Uh, I can't remember what they're called. Uh, flag girls? I don't know. Uh, anyway, you ready to end this vlog? So me and Haley was been talking, and, and instead of having like a full on Q and A only vlog. We thought about doing like answering y'all's questions maybe one and two at a time each vlog. So if you want to start leaving your questions and uh, and or comments in the comment section below, we'll start answering for you. And uh, maybe that'll give you, uh, you know, I think that'd be real cool. Instead of just having them set the day aside and answer all these questions, we can just slowly answer them one by one. So, and don't be scared. If you've asked us a one, uh, if you've already asked us a question, uh, Ask us another one. I mean, shoot, you know, we'll answer any question that you have. All right, guys, we're going to go ahead and end today's vlog. Uh, Delaney Boo is feeling a little better. Ain't that right? You feel better? Mm -mm. Oh, you don't? I'm sorry. Mm -mm. <laughs> but uh, we're going to do something a little different. If you watch this vlog all the way through, tell me how many fingers Delaney is holding up. Hold up, hold up a mini. How many, hold up. How many fingers can you hold up? So, if you've seen that, She's holding up three fingers. Comment below. See y'all later. Bye.